I'm John Lundgren, and I helm Ecdysis Foundation of Ludasha Farm, where we have a, a young and enthusiastic staff of, of scientists that are, that are trying to change the world. Science and agriculture right now is broken. We're doing incremental science, uh, solving incremental problems, uh, avoiding controversy at all costs, and, and supporting a broken system. We at Blue Dasher Farm think that we need desperately a transformational change in how we're doing food production in this country. And transformational science doesn't come from a statistical package or a peer-reviewed paper. The kind of change that we need comes from listening quietly to the natural world. It comes from art and beauty and being creative and appreciating those things. But most of all, transformational science comes from your heart. Right now, the bees are dying. We've spent hundreds of millions of dollars in trying to solve this problem through traditional science, and it isn't working. We lost as many bees this year as we did 10 years ago. The current system is broken. At Ecdysis, over the last three years, we've put together a framework that we think is really going to help us solve the bee problem. But it... It isn't anything that's going to get funded through traditional funding mechanisms. We need one and a half million dollars. And with that money, we could hire on an, a staff of outside the box thinking scientists who could come in here and provide a natural solution. At the end of three years, a natural solution that beekeepers could implement in their own operations that would stem the hemorrhaging losses that we're currently experiencing until we can reform agriculture, which is ultimately the, the answer to the bee problem. No committees, no reporting, no waiting for the peer review process to happen, no chasing the next grant proposal. Let's focus and let's get this job done. That's bold. What we're proposing right now is really bold, but Bold action is what we desperately need right now. There is a sense of urgency. We want you to give us a shot at this. Uh, we've proven ourselves many times over over the last three years. And when you think about it, $1.5 million isn't that much money compared to the hundreds of millions that we've already spent unsuccessfully to solve this problem. Folks, it's the end of the game here. We need a Hail Mary pass. Please give us this shot.